What's up, DFS players? We are going to be going through the best WNBA and MLB. This is a cross-sport prize picks entry. I have baseball picks. I got basketball picks. So as a recap from yesterday, we did decent, lost our WNBA play. We did decent on baseball. Ended up being an up day, so hopefully we can keep it going today. Um, but anyways, what I like to do at the start of every video, just so people have context on prize picks if you haven't used it before, is this is a fixed payout parlay platform. I mean, that's literally what prize picks is. Any two picks you select, doesn't matter, overs, unders, you're going to see 20 to win 60, 20 to win 40 in profit, which is just plus 200 odds. Doesn't matter if you switch from overs to unders, doesn't matter if you change around the specific pick you're going with, 20 to win 40 in profit is just plus 200 odds. So we've gone through this before, but essentially that means that prize picks is giving you the implied price on any player prop of minus 137 because a two leg parlay where both legs are minus 137 is plus 200 odds. So if you have questions about this, feel free to comment them below. But you know we've gone through this math in a bunch of other videos, so I won't dwell on it, but there will be a video linked in the end screen. So let's go ahead, let's get into my two picks for today. So first let's start out on the odds jam, you know, positive EV betting tool. So we know that prize picks is giving us the implied price of minus 137 on all our picks, but it's called implied price because it's not like you can place a one pick entry on prize picks. You need at least two picks to place an entry. So the first bet I'm going with on prize picks for today is going to be Jose over five and a half hits allowed, right? You can see that right here. Jose over five and a half hits allowed has pretty ridiculous value. Um, you can see that pinnacle. So the sharpest bookmaker is pricing this all the way up at minus 189. So we're using the lines on sportsbooks to find sharp bets on prize picks. You can see this pick has a profit margin of 5.67%, right? Typically, when the sportsbooks have something juiced at minus 189 and you're able to get it in your prize picks entry, that's a great prop to include, right? Because again, prize picks is not going to vary your payouts depending on if you select the over or the under. In the fact that, so let's just go to Jose real quick. So in the fact that sportsbooks have the over heavily juiced, right, to the tune of minus 189, means the over is a lot more likely to hit. So this is a first player prop we definitely want to go with today. Jose, over five and a half hits allowed. Sharpest bookmaker out there is pricing this all the way at minus 189. So you can see right here, all the way up at minus 189. So this is clearly a bet we want to be on, right? You can see the market on Pinnacle is minus 189 plus 140. So if we remove the juice from their market, we can see this prop is winning 61.08% of the time, um, which beats this break-even win probability on price picks. So this break-even win probability just means like, you know, if you're winning your props 57.74% of the time on price picks, each player prop in a two-pick entry you would break even in the long run. So ideally, you're winning your props at a higher clip, right? Like 60%. So we can see this is hitting at a clip of 61.08% according to the betting market on Pinnacle, which is the sharpest sports book. So we want to weight their odds and look for bets that are profitable to Pinnacle. So that's the first pick I'm going to go with. 61.08% win probability. Really, really good. Definitely should be in your prize picks entries for today. That's the first one I'm going with. Now, the next one we can see I ended up going with is Brianna Turner under, well, actually, first, I guess I can discuss the Discord as well. So I'd recommend that you guys, if you haven't already, we give out some free picks and stuff like that every day in the Odds Jam Discord. We also have a premium channel for, you know, prize picks, uh, stuff like that. So if you want all our picks, all my prize picks entries in real time, I think I have like 15 today or 10, you know, join the Discord. Um, there's a channel for sports betting. There's a channel for prize picks. So it's just DFS and sports betting. Get all our picks in real time. Obviously, I can't make 500 million YouTube videos a day. So any bets I ever place, you'll kind of see in this Discord, um, including on prize picks. So let's go ahead. Let's get back to Brianna Turner. Under six and a half assists. No, rebounds. I apologize. This player rebounds. So this is ridiculous. I mean, the value is ridiculous, right? Why is it ridiculous? You can see the sports books are setting Turner just browsing WNBA odds on Odds Jam, WNBA basketball, right? All the sports books are setting her line at over under four and a half rebounds. 
Prize Picks is setting it at over under six and a half. So two full rebounds higher. So bet 365, I mean literally every sports book. This is an insane line discrepancy on prize picks. So we want to be all over it, right? So we can continue to go down. Let's find Turner real quick. You know, just massive, massive line discrepancy um, on prize picks. More efficient betting markets are saying her projected rebounds in this game is over under four and a half. We can get under six and a half on prize picks. Ridiculous, ridiculous value. So I ended up locking this in as well, right? So this is a two pick entry. So we have Jose over five and a half hits allowed, Turner under six and a half rebounds. You can also, you know, if you like doing player prop historical trend research, there's a free Odds GM mobile app. So if you wanted to, you know, we could do some research on Jose um, for just like whatever, like hits allowed, walks. I mean, whatever props you want to bet on, this tool is pretty valuable um, on prize picks. You can look at historical trends, stuff like that. So we can see, you know, this hasn't looked actually great for us. His over, um, or, or this is walks, I apologize. So if we go to hits allowed, we can see right here, we're taking the over. The over's cashed nine out of 17 games a season. So you can kind of use this app to look at trends, how players are trending. But regardless, let's lock in this bet. Really good. Um, MLB prop, right? The sharpest bookmakers pricing it all the way up at minus 189. So obviously they think the over is a lot more likely to hit. And then we have Brianna Turner under six and a half rebounds, which is just a massive line discrepancy in the Storm Mercury game, right? This is exactly what you want to look for as a DFS player, right? So if you want all our picks in real time, you know, again, just join the Odds GM Discord. We'll get them all out to you every single day so you don't have to sit on the product all day long like we do um, and find these good bets. So locked it in, 50 bucks. Um, actually bet it before as well. So now I have a hundred bucks total on it and let's make some money on prospects today.